It's just if our HR department can't locate a bachelor's degree record for you, there's just no way of moving you forward with us. Well, how do you think I got my last job? I don't know that, Mr. Barnes. I mean, I'm not, I'm not a criminal or anything. And I'm not saying that you are. I'm not saying that you're wrong. But Mr. Barnes, we can't find any information on you previous to 2003. What you can do is contact your previous employers, get in touch with the HR department, and talk with your university. Get proof of a degree. I like what you offer, but my hands are tied. Help me secure him, grab his head. And what? We'll bring him out to the car. And then what? I don't know, we'll work it out on the way. To where exactly? I don't know. It's not like I've, I've done this before. Oh, really? You seem to be rolling out the ideas pretty easily. You've been watching CSI? Actually, I have. And God knows who knew he was coming over here today. Guy? Guy? This has happened. Like it or not, this has happened. And I'm sorry, but now you're involved too. You and I are gonna dispose of him, or we're going to prison. Got it? What, what's your plan? You're gonna bring her back, back to the room later? It, yeah, I'm not gonna do any of that. And yeah, you don't think there was anything sketchy about her at all? Like what? I mean, for one thing, she when she came in, she had one bucket to clean an entire bathroom. I thought it was weird. I'm telling you, something, something, something's going on. Enlighten me. What motel we're staying in, what motel room we're staying in. He starts flirting with the cleaning lady just like you were. They start getting the talking and then uh, put something in, in, the, in the drinks. These drinks? Yes. The tea that I'm about to drink right now. Yeah. Uh, delicious. You know what? Isn't it time for your medication? Relax. If you have to buy a girl's attention, that's probably not the kind of girl you want to end up with. No, no one knows whom we're going to end up with. We have dates to figure it out. I believe in fate. Uh, and how do you know what fate prepared for you if you're just sitting here and waiting? Are you happy? Of course. Then you don't need me. <laughs> Come on. I just invited you for one dinner. You can't sit and wait forever. Your bus is leaving.